Look, I know they're bigger, but can I ride in their pouches or, oh, we're on. Hey guys, I'm Trace Dominguez, filling in today for Katie and Alex on Animalist News. According to a new study from PLOS One and Brown University, kangaroo ancestors were so big, they probably didn't even hop. The study estimates that the Stenaris weighed possibly as much as 530 pounds, about three times the size of their modern-day kangaroo relatives. They determined hopping was unlikely for these giant creatures by looking at the bone structure and anatomy of the marsupial. Their feet were just one big single toe that ended in a hoof-like claw, and their skeletons were stocky for their size, with shorter tails than most kangaroos. Today, kangaroos have to hop around because though their bones are similar to ours, they don't use them in the same way. The roos can't move their legs independently, and instead of walking, they have to hop. Their femurs are short, their ankles are rigid, and their toes are mostly fused. All of this helps keep their powerful jumping that makes them just so hilarious. The ancient Stenaris, on the other hand, or on the other toe, probably walked around with a rabbit-like face and arms long enough to reach leaves. These kangaroos were more sloth-like than rueful, which reminds me of the giant sloths that used to live in the U.S. Is everything giant in the past? For more coverage of Rue's Strange Anatomy, check out our friends at thedodo.com, an animal news site for those who love animals just like us here on Animalist News. See the link down in the description. And for more discoveries that change the way we view prehistoric animals, check out this episode on a 600 million year old animal fossil. Would you like some perspective? I'm gonna get you some perspective. And here to help me is my handy dandy timeline. So here we are today, and about 200,000 years ago, the first anatomically modern humans evolved. Let us know in the comments which ancestors of other animals you'd like to know more about, and we will see you next time.